Hey everyone, it is Angela from Wisconsin. Yes, Appleton, Wisconsin. Anyway, I just wanted to give you guys a quick update on my health. It is what, oh my God, I don't even know what day it is. It is Tuesday, I want to say, at 8 p.m. And I have been literally in my pajamas watching Korean drama. And I am obsessed with Under the Queen's Umbrella. It is so good. So it's the new like series that I'm watching. But anyway, so I wanted to just give you guys a little update as to what's been going on with me. So Friday, this past Friday, I went to work and I was feeling fine. I worked out before work. And um, I started working and about an hour and a half into work, I started feeling really, really crummy. I'm like, this is kind of weird. And then all of a sudden within a half an hour, I could tell that I had a fever. <clears throat> I just wasn't feeling good at all. I felt like I got hit by a bus, literally. So um, I left work early and I came home and I was literally in bed from Friday morning at like 10.30 until Sunday at like 4 p.m. And I noticed like I was taking Tylenol every um, like five hours and my fever just wasn't improving. It was staying the same. It was like about 101, um, but it just wasn't improving. <clears throat> Um, hence why my voice sounds like it is now. And the only other symptoms that I really had was the fever and I had body aches, muscle aches, severe, severe headache. And I felt like my ears were going to literally burst. So, um, on Sunday I, you know, kept on taking that Tylenol thinking that it was just, you know, two or three days and it was going to be over and all of a sudden my my temperature with the Tylenol shot up to like 102.5 I was like you know what something's not quite right <clears throat> like I'm not getting any better I'm getting worse I need to go to urgent care so I probably shouldn't have done this but I drove myself to urgent care and they got me in right away and I saw the doctor and he was so, so sweet and kind. And I told him, you know, all my symptoms and things. And he immediately said, you know, do you have a cough? Um, and I said, you know, I, I am hearing wheezing, but I'm not sure if that's like my asthma kicking in. And he's like, are you prone to pneumonia? And I said, that's so weird because I'm supposed to get my pneumonia vaccine. I'm like due for it this year. <clears throat> so he listened to my lungs and he said, it definitely sounds like your left lung has pneumonia. He's like, I'm going to get you into x-ray right away. Got me into x-ray and lo and behold, my left lower lobe um, of my lung was filled with pneumonia. So he prescribed me two antibiotics, I had to go to Walgreens, get the antibiotics that was a pain in the ass because they had me drive literally three times through the drive through because it took so long. And I'm sure like they were busy or whatever, but it is what it is. Um, and yeah, my fever finally broke today. Um, I, sh I shouldn't say finally broke. It broke while I'm taking the Tylenol. So, um, and I don't really like taking ibuprofen because it upsets my stomach. But what was happening before is I was taking the Tylenol and I was still like having a fever with the Tylenol. Now my fever is like a hundred without the Tylenol and then like back to normal with the Tylenol. So my goal is to not take any fever medication and just be good with that. I'm taking the nebulizer. I'm taking my two antibiotics um, and I am just literally trying to rest. I'm pushing my fluids and I am just on bed rest and relaxing and watching my Korean shows. But 
I just wanted to give you guys a little update as to where I was and what was going on, why I wasn't uploading any videos. <clears throat> I'm not real sure when I'm going to be able to go back to work um, because the doctor said that, you know, this pneumonia may knock you out for a good month. He's like, depending on, you know, the severity of it, he said sometimes people, you know, bounce back super fast. He's like, but if you have damaged lungs already because of previous pneumonias, it's like, it could take a little bit. Um, so that's kind of where I'm at right now. I'm just relaxing and resting, but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much to all of you who checked up on me. Um, I did, I think I posted on Twitter stating, you know, that I wasn't feeling well. And I know I did on YouTube. I made a little post about how I have pneumonia, but I just wanted to say, yeah, again, thank you guys so much for checking up on me. I am fine. I'm still alive. Jen did not do this to me. Um, and yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully I'll be able to record the Angela and Judy show, uh, soon, but if not, then Maybe I'll make another little Korean video soon. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and listening. And I will see you guys all soon, hopefully. Bye, everyone.